First pitch coming. Swing and a ball hit well to the right side, but this will get into the crowd. Now here's the pitch. Oh, and he's really getting the better of him now. It's strike two. Yeah, when that's upstairs like that, that's a pitch you've got to leave alone and make him bring something down. Swing and a ball lifted in the air toward the line and right. Under it is Young, and he takes it for route number two. Chris Carter will stand in for the first time now, and he'll do so as the fourth leading hitter in the American League. Now here's the first pitch. Bounce toward the hole and through into left field for a base hit. Evan Gaddis will get a shot here with two away and a runner at first now following the base hit. That two-out single seemed harmless enough, but anytime you extend the inning to allow this guy to get a shot with a runner on, you better be careful. And this ball is going to find the seats down the left field line. Foul strike one. He's set. Now the pitch. Now a ball hit in the air to left center. And Gardner there to make the catch. Inning over. One left for Houston. He played two innings. It's one to nothing. Alex Rodriguez stand in now to lead things off. Seven, eight, and nine here to start the third inning. And maybe one of these guys can break this string of six straight retired to start the ball game. Ball one. Yeah, and when your team still doesn't have a hit, you appreciate a call like that once in a while. Up high, two and one now. Pitch on the way. To two and two now. One of the things that makes him so tough to hit, the ability to put his pitches right on the black. Yeah, I mean, you watch the catcher's glove on some of these, and it literally does not move. That's how good his stuff is. And as we showed you in the open, he's out there putting his perfect record on the line. And so far, these guys haven't shown many signs that they're ready to put a one in that loss call. Now the first pitch. Chris Young comes on with one gone here as he looks at a called strike one. I tell you, he's got a good pace, a good tempo to him out there right now. And a swing and a miss by Young as he's prone to do, and he falls behind here, nothing in two. And they get four strikeouts in a row as this is swung on and missed for the second out. Brendan Ryan will stand in now with two away, trying to avoid another one, two, three inning. Yeah, this has been total domination these past few innings. They haven't been able to mount any kind of threat whatsoever. Now a swing and a fly ball. And foul. Now the pitch. Lays off that time, and it's one and two. That's a good location for that cutter with two strikes. He's either got to take that and hope it's a ball, or he's got to foul that thing off. Now another one, two. Driven nicely into the gap, and it's going to get down and should be extra bases. Around first on his way to second now. And he'll make it in there with a two-out double. Brett Gardner will get an opportunity here in a run-scoring spot now following the two-out double. Now a swing and a miss. Took something off that one, and it's strike one. Oh, and he can't come up with it. Chase Headley will come forward now in an RBI opportunity. He probably didn't think he'd have. Yeah, it certainly didn't look like he'd have one, but now's where you really have to make teams pay. Nothing will demoralize a team in the field. And we'll have to leave it there as this is strike three, and that will retire the side. A golden opportunity to get on the board. Here goes for naught. More in a moment on the show, the Friday Night Showcase. Hank Conger will stand in, back in the lineup after getting the night off yesterday. First pitch coming. Started to go around there, but he holds up ball one. And I think that might have been a first. The first ball they've taken the entire game. Sound the trumpets. And this is lined right back up the middle. Oh, and he has some trouble with it. And now, fortunately, they will get an out here. 
And I thought this might happen based on how close that play was at first. The skipper's out of the dugout, and it looks as though he might decide to challenge that out call. Yeah, he wasn't so sure that was the right call. And looking at it again right here, I don't know if I can tell for sure either. We'll wait to see what the guys in the dugout say after reviewing this play a couple of times, probably. So here's the signal from the bench, and they will indeed ask for the play to be reviewed. So the umpires will get on the horn with the replay operations center in Manhattan and attempt to get a definitive answer on this play. The Astros are challenging the previous... All right, we'll take one last look at it here. Now, the question is, if there's enough video evidence to change the call to safe, and wow, from that look at it, I think he did beat the throw, and this might be a well-used challenge. The decision appears to have been made as the headset comes off, and the runner is safe. So the call is overturned. The runner will stay at first base, and they maintain the right to challenge further plays going forward. Here's the second baseman, Jose Altuve, as he's swinging first pitch and sends a line drive out to left center. And that's into the gap and should be extra bases. I tell you, this guy's had a great series so far, and we haven't even hit the weekend yet. He's on base yet again as he drives this one out to the wall for a double. Here's Luis Valbuena now as he lines this one out to center. And that's in there. Base hit. And now they've got a man out there with nowhere to go. And he will make it back in there. He's safe at third. George Springer will dig in here with a chance early on to give his pitcher a little cushion to work with. Here's the first pitch to him. Swinging a ball hit on the ground, but a foul ball here, 0-1. Here we go. He's ready now. The pitch. Waved at and missed, and he's behind 0-2. Come set. Now the pitch. Tried to get him to go after one below the knees, but it's one and two. Yeah, and he didn't want that one to be in the strike zone. Even with the bases loaded, this is still a strikeout situation, remember. Fouled straight back. We need a run here. Needs a punch out here. Can he get it? And a check swing here, but the bat clearly breaks the plane as he set down for the first down. Jed Lowry will stand in with a golden opportunity to open this thing up early on. Now here's the first pitch. Hit hard to third, but gloved by the third baseman for the out. Jake Marisnik will be the batter. Over one here in the early going. First pitch to him. Here we go. Here's the ball hit pretty well and carrying to deep right. And this is down for extra bases, and it might chase everybody home. One run scores. And it's in time, and he's out at the plate. So one runs across, but the second one is cut down.